Hey guys, thanks for voting for me on the King of the Web. I did end up winning $500. So, uh, instead of spending the money on beer and crack, I decided to run another contest for my background. Now you can find all kinds of templates and stuff online for the size. And uh, whoever wins will get the... There's only one winner and you'll get the whole $500. But if I end up using your background later... Uh, I'll definitely give you something, but, uh, and I'll have, like, I'll post a topic on the league forums, and you can email me at this email, dunktown at live.com, and, uh, I'll have, like, a resource with all the donkey pictures from the other contest that you can use in the background if you want. Right here in the video, you can see I'm already getting a head start on the competition, uh, I'm photoshopping, uh, uh, I'm drawing this uh, beautiful Bulbasaur portrait, and uh, right now you can see I'm going in, I'm taking a darker shade of green, I'm going in for the vines, and that's going to come off of the back of Bulbasaur's back, so, and that's going to just come on to the camera, just whip right out you, action shot, you know, that's really going to, he needs those whips to uh, to get to the leaves that he eats because uh, he's a leaf, he's a carnivore. And you see this, this vine, uh, I'm gonna actually give him two vines, because two heads are better than one, so, so vines are the same thing. And for the face, ooh, for the face, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. Boom, three strokes, and the face is pretty much done. Uh, it's pretty much done for us. And then I'm going to add the nose. Let's go in. Let's just, with the same brush, let's add the chin and that eyebrow. And it's starting to come together now. You see, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go in for a little, a little lighter shade of green here for the eyeball. And add one here. And for the pupils, I'm going to go to almost black. And just, just beautiful. And the mount and a little chin. And let's go ahead and let's give them uh, cheeks, cheekbones. And let's give them a nice strong chin. Yeah. And this is really coming together here. Now you see I've skipped ahead a little. I've added the uh, realistic Bulbasaur spots onto him. And I'm uh, using the smudge tool, which, uh, which is often overlooked in Photoshop. And I'm just gonna smudge these spots into the into the skin so it just blends in really realistically like that. And I'm just gonna smudge the shit out of this thing. Just, 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 just beautiful. Beautiful. Now this is where the whole thing starts to come together. I uh, found a picture of Bulbasaur on Google Images, and then I just paste it right into the dead center of the screen, and now it looks just like Bulbasaur. So there you go.